If you still doubt that things are kind of lining up for AMC to short squeeze, this video will be interesting, okay? You want to watch till the end, even though it's going to be really short. <laughs> so in one of the latest video, I share with you guys the latest invest, I mean, uh, institutional investor who bought AMC shares. I think he bought uh, uh, about 71,000 shares of AMC. Now, what is interesting is AMC, um, alongside other another company in the crypto space in the name of SOS Limited, uh, kind of have the same similarities in terms of you know being heavily shorted. Um, but what is interesting is that same investor also bought a huge amount of shares in that other company, which is also heavily shorted. So, what does that mean? So, first off, if you look at AMC short interest right now at 31%. Uh, um, shorts available to share back to 150,000. Um, fee short uh, borrow fee rate up to 20%. Okay. Now compare that to SOS Limited. This is a company involved into the crypto space. They are kind of a, a, a Bitcoin slash Ethereum miners. So the short interest on this is also. I mean, it's 13%, okay, 13%, but um, short shares availability, 7,000. Short borrow fee rate, 30.55%. And if you look at um, uh, back where the volume, the short ratio was at a point, it was at 28%, you know, around that 20, 25%, which is overwhelmingly high, but 13% is still high. Now, what is interesting about this is that SOS Limited, um, that investor, you know, Equitec Proprietary Markets, who bought uh, 115,000 shares of SOS Limited on the 19th of April, it's also the same company that bought AMC on the very same day. So if we go back to institutional owners on AMC within Fintel, you will definitely see that um, on April 19, Is that the right? Yeah. So um, you have to update, give it a second. Yep. So here it is. April 19, Schedule 13 Air from the SEC, Equitech Proprietary Market. So the very same day, this company both a significant amount of shares of AMC and SOS. Okay. So on Bloomberg, this is the profile of the company. Um, sector financial it is a uh, uh, operates as a broker the company offered stock brokerage services uh, founded on March 2001 so we don't have much more employee uh, 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 data around whatever they do but guys this means they know something okay they know something that we all know and they came into agreement you know that uh, uh, um, it may be a smart investment to put your money and talking about a, a good chunk of money here into SOS and AMC, you know, this, the very same date. Why? Just because everything is kind of lining up. OK, so we have the rule on the SEC uh, a website for the staff statement fully paid lending that will require or enforce uh, uh, um, hedges to have much more capital requirements if they want to continue to short the companies in AMC and SOS Limited. OK. So maybe these guys know something about something to happen. So why would they put money into both AMC the very same dates? You know, to me personally, I think since these two stocks are heavily shorted, definitely they see, you know, a big upside multiplying potentially their money. I don't know, 10, 20, 50, 54, 500 times. And that's why they put money. OK, whenever institutional investors get into a play is to make big bucks so i will just stop here guys and let you sit let that sit with you and um, if you were still doubting that this thing may happen i guess you have a piece of answer